Now, another thing I knew before I joined the Navy is some people are taught it's better to die than sin. Right. Well, that means is Ben would have to kill me or black me out to have sex with me in my mindset before I joined the Navy. You understand? It wouldn't change. It wouldn't change either. So you can't change me into gay or bi when I say I'm not gay or bi from the start. During, or I'm saying it sarcastically to you because I've been with two girls within a 48-hour period. And I mean something different than you, right? <laughs> when I'm saying I'm bi, right? <laughs> So I broke up with one girl, went back to my ex, had breakup sex with her, and then broke up with her. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. To me, that's as bi as I can get. Mm -hmm. Legally, because Jacob did that to Leah and Rachel. Mm -hmm. Or Hagar and Sarah mm -hmm. did that with Abraham. Mm -hmm. I'm still coming from the Bible with that, by the way. Mm -hmm. Though I'm still just trying to find a woman right now as I was taught, though I wouldn't mind a menage a trois, which is the two women being bisexual and me being with two women, right? See? See. That's still a gayish thing, right? In that sense, I am gay, right? I would be with two women over two men <laughs> with one woman, right? Even, even. In my choice of the sexuality I have, right? Or you're denying people their choice in sexuality. Because you're trying to rape people into it. I don't know. You can't rape people into it, gay people. You can't force people to be gay with you. Who don't feel gay with you. Through sexual means. I don't know. That's called rape. It'll always be rape on the law. They can call it rape if a male rapes a male. Mm -hmm. And blacks him out to where he don't remember what happened. Right. And that's why Captain Carey being a Marine, if Ben told him all this, personally, is lying. is lying. He's trying to get Carey to think I'm gay. Right? Even if it was in 93. Even if it was in 93. That he told him all these lies, right? Because who would know? But someone who could set it up or force it to happen. Right? I'm still being subordinate. Not he mine. That's right. That's quid pro quo. It always will be. I know. I don't have the choice. He's the superior officer or the superior enlisted man. I know. That means he had all the power. Not me. I know. Even if I said no and he insisted. Yes. Yes. And the only reason you're doing now is because people are more tolerant towards gay people. Right. I told you that too. You can't do that if the person never said they were gay. <laughs> gay. Saying you're bisexual ain't being gay, you know. <laughs> There's more than one way to be bisexual too. You can be with two women. Or more than one woman. No, no. I told you that too. My opinion, <laughs> which is based on the Bible, right? Not you. Not you. Or your beliefs. I don't know your beliefs. Right. I would be better to be with a prostitute than a male. Mm -hmm. As long as it's a female prostitute, not a male prostitute. I would never be with a male prostitute either, either, right? Only a female. Mm, a female. <laughs> and that's my opinion, reading the whole Bible, by the way, too, right? And Hosea married a harlot, too. That's the King James equivalent of a prostitute. <laughs> By the way, and I can yell at you, Jesus shout when they cast out the temple changers, the money changers at the temple. You can get mad, Joel Osteen. Get mad once in a while. Nothing wrong with it. If you're justified in your anger, like Jesus was. <laughs> Be zealous for the Lord, Joel. <laughs> Once in a while, brother. <laughs> or you're being better than Jesus. Right? Are you better than Jesus, Joe? He got mad with these idiots. <laughs> Why don't you? I don't know. Once in a while, huh? <laughs>
But that's okay. You're perfect, Joel. Even Jesus ain't better than you. Brother. <laughs> Don't get mad at him. <laughs> so you have a better character than Jesus himself, huh? <laughs> Thank God thinks so, though. <laughs> Mm -hmm. yeah, but whatever, whatever. <laughs> but be angry and sin not. Let not the sun go down upon your wrath. Did it and do what? Let it go. Don't hold it on to it. Don't let it become wrath. Right. They're trying to piss you off anyway. If you deal with them the same day, right? Even if they keep bringing up the topic, they're just trying. To make you mad. Right? But you're teaching them. I know. Grace too. Even if you get mad. Right. Because being mad with someone. Don't mean you're trying to hurt them. They just won't listen to you. That can make you mad too. Right. You're trying to warn them. They're going to hell with Satan. And they don't want to listen to that. So they're still going to go to hell with Satan. You be sorry for them. Mm. Even if they're too down to be sorry for themselves. <laughs> you understand, right? <laughs> they're too stupid human beings to be sorry for themselves that Satan has beguiled them and is dragging them down the hill with him. Whether they know it or not. They don't have to know they're doing wrong to, when their judge know they were doing wrong. <laughs> when you stand before the great judge God on the white throne with as a light. Mm -hmm. You will know all your sins. And either Jesus will come forward to defend you, Joel, or he won't. <laughs> By the way, too. He's your defense attorney here. Mm -hmm. Satan is the accuser of the brethren. He's trying to get you for every sin. Mm -hmm. But there are times you're justified mm -hmm. for being a little angry. Mm -hmm. Even Paul was angry at those who wouldn't listen to him, too. Right. Or wouldn't follow him as he was following Christ sometimes. Right. And he's trying to be open-minded with you. Mm -hmm. When even dealing with marriage or a virgin, you're not reading the whole passage. You're taking parts of the passage mm -hmm. and changing the old and new points. Right. And making the wrong point. Right. Instead of the right point. <laughs> Which that's what it's for. To understand it all. How grace works to save us all. Even the unjust. If they repent in the end. Right. It doesn't even matter. I put my trust. In Yahuwah. I pushed as far as I could go. But for all this, there's only one thing you should know. I put my trust in God, cause only he can see me true. For all this, there's only one thing you can do.